here are the directions for the workplace cover-up. What you'll need is a record sheet in which both partners will share, two spinner overlays, as well as four crowns or colored pencils that are different colors, and one black crown or colored pencil. To begin this game, each player will spin the spinner once to see who has the bigger number to determine who will go first. If player one had the bigger number whenever they spun the spinner, then they will go first. They will start by spinning both spinner overlays once to find their dimensions of the array they're going to build. In this case, the dimensions are four by five. So it's equivalent or equal to four times five meaning there will be 20 square units colored in this round by player one. Player one can choose to make their array however they like as long as it matches the dimensions that they spun. For example, they can do five up and down and then four side to side and color all those in to get all 20 of those square units colored. Then player two will do the exact same thing as player one, and they will spin both spinners to get their dimensions. In this case, they spun two by five. So they will be coloring in 10 square units. The goal of this game is to see who gets closest to 100. Whoever that is, they are the winner. You have four turns to see who is closest to 100 when filling in your arrays. If the dimensions don't fit, then the player loses a turn unless they're able to make two different arrays that are smaller that equal the same amount of the dimension spun. Those are the end of the directions for the workplace cover-up. If you are interested in doing different variations of this game, instead of having four times be the limit for players to play, you can switch it to the, where each player spins five times to get closest, or do the opposite and do fewer times if they're having a challenge fitting all of the pieces into the grid. Another alternative for this game is rather than playing against one another, they can play as a team to see how many times they can fit in one grid to get closer to 100.